LFD believes that this fire could have started from a lightning strike. It is being contained to just the attic of this building right here. Uh, fire crews say that this is a historic building. It used to be a school called the Frank T. Howard School. It is being converted into apartments. And OFD Superintendent Timothy McConnell says fire crews have been out here since 4 o'clock working to put this fire out. Uh, we had fire heavy in the attic when the companies got here, and I have to say the firefighters arrived, did a fantastic job. Really a difficult fire. You get here, the building's secured, and then the fire is all located in the attic that you got to find. They did a fantastic job, got it knocked down. We're not under control just yet. But uh, you can see clearly that the amount of smoke has diminished a lot from, from when we first got here. No injuries have been reported. And at this time in the investigation, Superintendent Timothy McConnell believes that this fire started with a lightning strike. I'm Natalie He with WDSU News.